shirt said London. Hi guys, I'm in Las Vegas and I'm flying out in a little bit but I wanted to show you what I got at the Sephora because I forgot some makeup and had to go there and I thought hey, this might be fun to show you guys what I got. So I was in town for the Miss USA contest which was super awesome and so much fun to see and if you follow my blog you saw that I got to meet Jeff Robertson from Duck Dynasty which I totally love that, that was like the highlight and Betsy Johnson was one of the judges so that was, I love her too. Now this is like my Vegas big spender haul. You go big in Vegas, so I went big with the brand. This is no drugstore brand haul. This is like crazy haul of high priced products that work incredibly well though. First I will show you, I needed a foundation. I got the Dior Skin Air Flash, which this is very pricey, but it works so well. Um, I got two, I got a lighter color, and then I always use a darker color for like around the face. So I got one in Sand Sable and one in Honey. And it kind of looks like this, and then you just shake it up, and then you apply it on a brush. You do not spray this right on your face. It will come out so ugly. You spray it on the brush, and then put it on. I don't care what the can says. You can try it like they say, and it's gonna come out horrible. These were expensive. Like if I should have won the jackpot to buy them. I don't know how much were they. Wait a minute. That foundation was $62. Are you kidding me? What? Oh my gosh. I did not realize these are $62. This better last me a really long time because that is a lot of money. I will say it does make your skin look amazing, so maybe it is worth the $62. Ay, 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 that food. Then I wanted a face powder and I got the NARS Light Reflecting Setting Powder. I got the loose powder and I will tell you this is kind of amazing. It just reflects light, like it makes your pores and your skin look incredible. I have it on today and this is just really amazing. I'm so glad I bought this and tried this. How many thousands of dollars was this? Oh, this was 34 compared to the other one. It's only $34, what a deal. I needed mascara and so the girl there told me that I should try the Dior Show Maximizer, which is a primer. I'm a big fan of primer and I normally just use the L'Oreal, the drugstore, the double extend tube that has a primer and it's like $8. Then for mascara, I tried the Givenchy Phenomenize Mascara. Its bristles are like these funny little spiky balls. So you can get like in every corner and you can get the tops and you get in the corners and the edges really well where it's not like you're sticking a big wand. So guess how much this was? $30. Still seems like a bargain next to that $62 foundation. Now for extra bonus fun, I didn't realize how fancy I was gonna need to be dressed for the Miss USA pageant. So I had to race around like so crazy fast yesterday trying to find an outfit. So I'll show you what I got. For these awesome shoes that I just kind of love. Look at the Lucite heel, it's like, it is awesome with the gold in it. And these are from Chinese Laundry. I they're called they're called the Elise, like my Ellie. Fancy pants I look because I felt pretty fancy. I, I wore these sparkly diamond hoopy earrings I got at the BB store. And then this necklace I got at the guest store, which is also where I got my dress, which I don't have. It's packed in my suitcase already. But it was like this long, flowy, kind of lavender pinky dress. And then my hair was cut really short the other day and I was gonna just not wear like a headband or scarf or anything, but it was really short. So at the last minute I put my orange like vintage scarf, I just tied it like a headband on. And surprisingly, I got a lot of compliments of people stopping me and telling me how amazing my headscarf thing was. And Jeff Robertson that I met that was sitting right in front of me at Miss USA, he said he really liked my hair. And so I thought that was super awesome. And then after that, I went to their VIP party for like a minute, and then I was like, oh, I said hi to everybody, now I just feel like the girl at the dance that didn't come with anybody and is just like looking around pretending like she's looking for someone, but she's really not. And so I just went home <laughs> to my hotel room. And then we went to go get a burger at the Gordon Ramsay Burger Place in Planet Hollywood. <gasps> their food there is so dangerously, deliciously good. If you go there, they have a toffee, a creme brulee, pudding, milkshake with Oreo cookies. It is the best, one of the best things I've ever tasted in my whole life. It was amazing. And they had these Maui onion rings with Parmesan cheese on top and sweet potato fries with vanilla powdered sugar sprinkle on top. It was like my taste buds were in crazy land because they were like, what is this food you're giving us? This is the most amazing thing I've ever eaten in my whole life. So huge hugs from Las Vegas. 
and me to you, and I'll see you in the next video. Oh, and make sure you could be my friend on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. I'll put all the links below, and you can go see what I type up for you every day, all the fun stuff on my vlog, which is Candy J. Is that a J? Maybe J's this way, J.com. I'll put all the links below. Everywhere I'm Candy Johnson, except for Facebook, I'm Candy the Makeup Artist, and I'll put a link below for that one too, so you can be my best friend everywhere on the internet. And goodbye, adios, Las Vegas. I'll see you in the next video, bye!